Hey guys, I'm going to show you the comparison between Abeka and Christian Light Education CLE for learning how to read and their phonics. So I'm basically going to show you the similarities and differences. So in Abeka, they start teaching kids in pre-K four how to read. And I think they end with like four letter words, maybe dual, I think double consonant words. And their official start is kindergarten because you know, all kids start in kindergarten. And in kindergarten, so you don't have to do their pre-K four, you can just start in kindergarten with a Becca. And that's where they start off with the five vowels. They do the, um, you do five vowels and they do the consonants. They start teaching you blends like, you know, ta, 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 whatever. Then they turn into words. Then they do more stuff like the phonics blends and two letter words and like they do like the like long vowel sound and all that anyways cle has a totally different approach they start in grade one and i would almost start learning to read in kindergarten now that i know what i know i would start this in kindergarten this is their beginning you start with learning to read it's like their whole little curriculum comes with 10 of these little red workbook light units and at some point in here it says okay now you're ready for the reading and, and the language arts. So go ahead and start that. So they kind of get you started a little bit with learning to read and then they incorporate the more big kid stuff of grade one. But there's a lot of similarities and there's also a lot of differences. So with CLE, you buy the light unit and it, and it has the, the quizzes and the test in here. And you have a teacher's guide and you've got the phonics letter flashcards, and then you have the phonics cards, and that's that. CL or Abeka, you buy, you buy a workbook, you buy, um, you buy everything separate. You buy a separate spelling book, you buy the teacher key, which is the answers from the workbook, then you buy a curriculum lesson plan, then you buy their tests and test keys separately, so it's all different. So anyways, I'm just going to kind of flip through here and show you some similarities that I have found. It might all, it might not all line up as far as like this for this, this for that, but I'm just going to just show you some examples here. Okay. So here's an example of their language arts one. So here's an example of where they have a lesson. Consonant diagraph, ch, ch, chat, rich, chill, chase, much, chip. Circle the correct consonant diagraph. And then you just see ch or sh for, you know, shame, the for then, wa or sh. Anyways, that's, that's an example. And then here's like a new concept. So this is, that's their language arts. And then here, this is, the letters and sounds from Rebecca. So they have like the language, I think, and then the letters and sounds. So this is like the one that's like heavy in phonics. So here's the beginning of the letters and sounds. So it looks like this and it'll say like lesson two. You can kind of see here. And I'm going to be doing some other videos too, but I just wanted to show this to you. I made this little set thing here. So you kind of see where they're progressing here. The, they're, they've learned how to read in kindergarten and this is their grade one. So this is like the grade one phonics and continuation of reading. And you see how you got k in duck back, kick, deck, duck, truck, quick, sand, or sack, rock. And then, you know, they've got this here and then E and me. And this all goes right along with that learning to read handbook from Rebecca, which I've done another video on to show you. This one, handbook for reading, $17. I bought it for like $1.50 at another website, another place. But um, this is, they go right along with these, E and me, O and go, I, I and fly. So that's a and pray, st and stop. And they have some words to go with it. So I'm gonna put this away here. And then this is continuing on. So you have pl in plane, 
and then you have plus, 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 plus. So they're kind of showing you and then they want you to circle it, circle it, mark the vowels. So they want to see the long or the short vowel sound over the vowel. And then fra and sta are special sounds. And then, and it's like, I think it's a one lesson per, yep, one lesson per page, but they have a language book too. So, you know, sta and stove or fra and fro, right? Okay. So they're kind of just, this is the cut and neck, pl in plain, sta in nest, a and say. Okay. Then we have here, tr in train, trip, trail, trim, track, trot, trade. And then you're going to be connecting sounds. And then sh in ship, shed. Shut. So you see, you got about 10 words for this special sound. Okay. Then you got the, th, and then you've got um, bruh and bride, dr and drum, the words. So you understand this is one lesson. And I'm going to show you the difference. So it's really just up to you what interests you. Split in splash, split, splash, spruce brain. So then you have circle the special sound you hear in the picture word and then here scra and scream squa and squeak and then you have six words and six words with that special sound okay so I'm done with this book here or no I'm not I got another one here so ch in church or in morning okay I'm gonna just do another example here just because I think you kind of get the point so this is cut in chorus and f in phone. And you see the words here that they have. And then aw in thought, aw in caught. See? Okay, so now you've kind of got an idea of that. Now this is their learning to read. So this is light unit 107. So we have ch, new sound ch. Ch, cha, there we go. And you would really need your teacher's guide. You have to get the teacher's guide with this. If you don't get the teacher's guide, it's gonna be a hot mess. You gotta have it. I'm normally big on telling you like, be careful, you don't have to spend money here, you don't have to spend money there, but you have to spend money here. <laughs> if you don't have the teacher's guide, you ain't gonna know what to say. You gotta do it. So I'm always gonna like say something if I can that will help you save money at certain points, but I just wanna let you know you need this. If you're going to go with CLE, buy everything they have. Buy the flashcards or the alphabet cards, the phonics cards, the teacher's guides, get it all. Um, so you have blends. St, alt, cut, x, whatever. So I guess you just see st, it. Gets, so they, I guess, want you to just fill it in. Say the words, write the ending blend to make a word. So st, nest, st, fast, belt, felt welt next see and then write a word and then we have it again write an ending blend swick swisk or swift swift craft dusk grant or grasp I don't know which one it would be. Plant, clasp, prank, think. So you kind of see here, so this is an example of one. Okay, and then I'm gonna do a flip through of the other stuff so you can kind of get more an in-depth look. Okay, so here's scra, spla, spra, and stra. And then, you know, so they're, they're, they're just making it really easy. Put this in the front, scra, scrap, scra, scrub, stra, strap. And then here, make a sentence. And then here we have all these words. And then more of these blends. Okay, and then um, I'll show you in this book, there's a lot more examples here. 
So you have these blends and you, you kind of see the theme. They're teaching you, they've got some words as examples and you're gonna fill it in. Pla, sla, bra, cra. So you saw how they had, you know, in here they, the bra, they had the, um, they have it somewhere, bra and bride. Yeah, see, okay? Bra and bride. They have eight words. And then here is what you would see for that. And remember, both of these are spiral. So they're going to keep teaching concepts over and over. So your kid's not just going to get it once and forget. They're going to they're gonna hear it over and over and over. Okay, and then... Okay, so... Bra and broke. Bride. Braid. Okay, and then they're going to fill in these words here is okay okay there's that blah claw fla gla like glue and here dra fra gra pra tra and then more words um I'm going to do a more in-depth video of the learning to read and kind of go through it so you understand the differences. But you, you kind of get the point here. You see all these special sounds, right? And then um, there's more special sounds. Okay. And then here. Okay. Now I'm going to show you in the grade two of Becca, phonics and language, this is all in one. So you've... I'm, I, this is the answer key, but I'm just going to use this as an example. So you have K and duck. So pretend this is the child's workbook. You have K and duck. Circle the special sounds. Mark the vowels. So you see how they want you to circle the K and then do something with the vowel. Is it a long vowel or a short vowel sound? And then CK follows a short vowel. And KE is going to follow a long value. So tack and take. You're going to see how it's spelled differently. So they're teaching you that. Circle the special sounds. Mark the uh, circle under the correct word. So they're, they're, they got in there, bic or bike, and you know it's from this special vowel. So you just kind of have to decide what works for you. And this is going to be blank, and you need to buy this key. Even though you're going to know all the answers probably, you need to buy this key because you got to know what to say right here. <laughs> Or you can just make it up yourself, but it's kind of pointless. I didn't buy this teacher key at first, and I was like, what is this? <laughs> we were just going through a workbook. I spent like 130 bucks initially for my daughter going to second grade. I bought all the workbooks from Rebecca, and I've learned a lot now, so I know what I like and don't like, and what's useful and not useful, what I use, what I don't use. So you see here, E and me, O and go, I and fly, A and pray. When two words end with the same sound, we say they rhyme, gate and bait. So here's another one. Stu and stop, pl and plane, fr and frog, tr and train. So you kind of get an idea of how it's a little different in grade two. Okay. Shut and ship, th and thick, th and this. So um, I'll try to do more comparisons of this to that, but I just wanted you to kind of see how the books all are and the differences. And um, so hope this has kind of helped. I'm pretty much done now, but you kind of see the point here. You see these same special sounds throughout grade one and grade two and pre-K four, they do a lot too with Rebecca. So hopefully this will kind of help you remember with the CLE curriculum, they're putting more emphasis on reading in grade one. They kind of start off mild and gentle, fun, and then grade one, it's like, now we're ready. But if it was me, if you're gonna do CLE learning to read, I would probably start it in kindergarten. Don't put so much pressure on yourself and just slowly start easing into grade one with the language arts and the reading and the Bible and the math. And then just grade two, you're ready to go. Anyways, have a good day, bye.